Hi there, this is Ranjit from tech2bass.com and in this video I'm going to show you this Western Digital Red Drives and why you should use these Red Drives in a NAS compared to consumer oriented uh, drives from Western Digital for example the green or the blue one. So let me give you more info about these WD Red Drives. So this is the WD uh, Red Drive and I have this in a 3 terabyte capacity. You also get a 4 terabyte capacity but I purchased the 3 terabyte one and this is a normal hard drive and if you look at it it's very similar. It's the uh, same, the 3.5 inch form factor. And in fact, you can install this uh, red drive even in your standard desktop, but it's ideally designed for a NAS. And what makes it difference is that the firmware that Western Digital has put in this drive makes it different. And again, it specifies that it's a WD NAS hard drive. And Western Digital suggests this uh, drive for NASs uh, which have a, a one to six base. Uh, and the, the thing is with the NAS is that in uh, many of the NAS uh, you will have multiple drives and most of them will be in a RAID uh, environment. That means multiple drives. For example, if it's a RAID file if environment uh, and you might have four drives and all the four drives are used at the same time. And the problem with the standard hard drives is that they are designed for desktop environment like Windows etc. And generally with the desktop environment just a single drive is used at the same time but in a NAS environment it's RAID and all the drives are used at the same time. And whenever there is a problem with the drive for example in a standard hard drive the operating system like Windows will wait and let's say we are using a consumer grade hard drive like let's say Western Digital Green or Blue and let's say the operating system is Windows and let's say you have a problem with the drive and Windows will wait and the drive can recover from that it may might take a couple of seconds but the problem with the raid is that you have multiple drives and generally raid controllers will not wait that much so it will assume that the drive has failed and uh, your raid will get degraded so it's not a good thing and with these wd dread drives uh, western digital have special firmware that uh, uh, prevents that from happening also the second thing is that uh, with a NAS you have a lot of drives in a small bay hence uh, uh, there can be issues of vibration and also uh, noise levels can increase with normal hard drives but with uh, these drives uh, you get lower vibrations and also they are tuned for a lot more uh, vibration than standard hard drives and also uh, Western Digital says that these drives produce a lot less heat compared to the regular hard drive in terms of RPM, it's not a fast drive, it's just a 5400 RPM drive and it has 64 uh, MB of cache. And uh, the thing with these WD uh, RAID drives is that the mean time between failure is 1 million hours. Compared to that to a standard hard drive, for example, Western Digital Green Drive, that have about uh, 650,000 uh, hours of uh, um, mean time between failures. And also in terms of warranty, uh, these uh, red drives have three year warranty. The other drives generally have two years warranty. Again, these drives are not designed for, uh, to be used in enterprise. For that, we have WD RE drives, which are actually much more expensive than these. But for uh, small businesses, SMB and uh, uh, NASAs, between one to six base, uh, these uh, WD RED drives are the ideal ones. Again, in terms of pricing, they are a little bit expensive compared to normal WD green drives. For example, as you can see, uh, we I purchased this three terabyte drive and the pricing is 11,000 rupees. So yes, you do uh, pay a little bit of premium, but again, uh, these are designed to run with the uh, NASAs and also Western Digital has tested this uh, drive with uh, different rate controllers and also uh, many th third party NAS uh, manufacturers like Synology, QNAP, etc. have tested their NASAs with this drive. So these are the Western Digital red drives that are designed to be used with NASAs. Uh, it's not just Western Digital is uh, manufacturing these NAS hard drives. Uh, recently this year, Seagate has also introduced some NAS drives. So you can also have a look at them. Again, the capacity for these uh, red drives, they come all the way from one terabyte to four terabytes. I hope this video was helpful. Thanks for watching. This is Ranjit and I hope to see you in my next video.